Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to clear a jammed print queue on your Windows computer. So basically, if you're trying to print something and it's not printing out or it just seems to be stuck, this tutorial will be for you. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the Start menu. And you want to type in Printers. Best match should say printers and scanners on Windows 10. Windows 7 and Windows 8 should look a little different. I'm going to open that up here. And you want to find your printer and scanner from this list here. And then you want to select Open Queue. So on Windows 7 and Windows 8, you're going to go through the control panel. You're going to right click on the item, select properties. And you want to basically get to a screen that looks like this. Once you're done doing that, you want to go up to the printer tab at the top here. And then select Cancel All Documents. It's going to ask are you sure you want to cancel all documents. So that's yes. Again, you want to make sure you're doing that for the correct printer. You guys should only have one or two printers installed, and there'll be document names listed here. So obviously, if there's documents you're trying to print to, and you're sure that this name is the name of your printer, then there shouldn't really be any hassle with that. Now, if that does not resolve the issue, we're going to open up the Start menu, and we're going to type in Command Prompt. Best match should say command prompt. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you want to select yes. Now I'm going to have a couple commands in the description of the video I want you to paste in here. The first one's going to be net stop spooler, and we can just type that in, it's pretty straightforward. It's going to just be NET space stop space spooler. Keep in mind there's two O's in spooler, so net stop spooler, then you want to hit enter. I should say the print spooler servers is stopping and that it was stopped successfully. Now you want to basically paste in this second command here. So up at the top bar right here on the command prompt, you want to right click, edit, and then paste it in. Then you want to hit enter. And then once you have a blinking cursor, that means it's run successfully. And this again will clear this, the spooler. So we're going to close out of here at this point. Go back to star menu, type in services. Best match should say services right above desktop app. You want to left click on that. And you want to scroll down to get to print spooler right here. Left click on start the service up here at the top. And once you left click on the start up there, it should turn it back on. Again, if you don't want to go through there, you can always just right click on print spooler here. Left click on properties and then underneath startup type, make sure you set it to automatic and then service status should be running here. And you can always start the service if it's currently stopped. But I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.